They're in the gate. And they're off. A little stumble right after the break there for Life at 10. Nonetheless, it's Life at 10 is racing for the lead, and unrivaled Bell is right there with her. And it's Manitoba Miss is third on the outside. Funny Moon is out running fourth. And the early trailer is Pumpkin Shell. So down the back stretch run, it will be Life at 10 who leads. But Unrivaled Bell won't let her get away. She's just a length behind. It's a break of three back to Manitoba Miss, followed by Funny Moon, who's reserved. Six lengths for the front runner here, Life at 10. It was opening quarter, 23 and 1 fifth second, escorted down the back stretch by favored Unrivaled Bell, who's now right at her neck. Now it's a six length break back to Manitoba Miss. Funny Moon still conserved. Another three or four back to Pumpkin Shell. Five furlongs to go. Life at 10, Unrivaled Bell is just glued to her as they hit the far turn. Life at 10, three quarters of a length. Unrivaled Bell right there with her. They ran a half. 45 and two fifth seconds. The pace is a strong one here. It's still Life at 10, Unrivaled Bell. There's still one, two. Seven lengths back now, and Funny Moon starting to come alive. Funny Moon coming alive with three furlongs to go. Life at 10 on Rival Bell. They've been 1-2. That way all the way around the racetrack. As Funny Moon draws in closer, they've run three quarters in 108 and 2. It's been a demanding pace here for Life at 10 and Unrivaled Bell. Funny Moon trying to close in on them at the top of the stretch. Unrival Bell cannot get to Life at 10. Life at 10 has turned back on Rival Bell, but can she turn back Funny Moon? There's a 16th to go, and it's Life at 10 clear by three on Rival Bell and Funny Moon on the outside. They're coming down to the finish, and Life at 10 has won the Ogden Phipps in front running style. Unrivaled Bell was able to manage second there, Funny Moon third.